You see, I got to thinking about the poem I did yesterday, only one verse of it, and I thought, I used to know something inspired by the Bayer Tapestry and Magna Carta and the invasion of, uh, uh, <laughs> of William uh, in 1066. And I thought, I, need, I, 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 I used to know that once, but I couldn't remember a word of it now. But I've looked it up and, the, <laughs> and I think... <laughs> I think it's come back to me. So, I'll tell of the Battle of Hastings, as happened in days long gone by, when Duke William became a King of England, and Harold got shot in the eye. It was this way. One day in October, the Duke, who were always a toff, having no battles on at the moment, had given his lads the day off. They'd all taken boats to a fishing when some chap in Congress here said, Let's put, put breeze up Saxons, said Bill. By gum, that's an idea. They started... <laughs> oh, I've, I've whisked the boat out now. <laughs> Of Mr. Burke's. Yes, I don't remember it entirely because I. Oh! I <laughs> <laughs> so, turning around to his soldiers, he lifted his big, big Norman voice, so shouting, Hands up, who's coming to England? That was swank, because he hadn't a choice. <laughs> They started away about tea time. The sea was so calm and so still that at a quarter to ten the next morning they arrived at a place called Bexhill. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to stop now because I don't think I'd remember all the verses without <laughs> without a, a, a crib. <laughs> anyway. Okay, Google, tell me a joke. What do you get when you put a vest on an alligator? An investigator. Oh, okay. Well, that's it for today. <laughs>